Ever since I qualified as a doctor, I've worked in mental health services and I'm really passionate about providing good quality of care for people with mental health problems. The vast majority of the services we provide are for the residents of Coventry and Warwickshire, but we have to work with our other NHS partners, social care partners and third sector partners to make sure that the patient experience is joined up and seamless. So we are working really hard to make sure that our care pathways mesh with other people's care pathways, that they can move from being in hospital to our services in the community as quickly as possible and as seamlessly as possible for them. Our clinical strategy is called Using Value to Deliver Care with Compassion. So the aim of the strategy is to put patients at the centre of care and their outcomes, both their clinical outcomes and their experience outcomes at the centre of all that we do. This means developing care pathways and multidisciplinary teams to deliver that high quality care with also concentrating on making sure we use our resource as effective as possible. We've been working on the strategy for the last two or three years and what we've achieved is we have set up our teams, which we call IPUs, with, which have lots of different types of staff, including doctors, nurses, physios, occupational therapists, who all work together to provide care for patients. And those teams all know what the outcome is they're trying to achieve and working hard to let patients manage their own care. I'm really proud of the work that the teams have done so far in getting the team set up and the care pathways in place and I'm really proud of the staff for the, the time and effort and the passion that they put into it. We've got a lot more work to do in terms of really getting the, the, the teams to work together in a way that the patients themselves can see that we're working in a seamless way. By working together on the same outcomes, um, our clinicians and our patients and their carers really focus on what matters in terms of clinical recovery and health and well-being, and therefore everybody's working in the same direction to achieve the same aims. One of the things we've been particularly working on by developing these teams aligned to the pathways is that they're assessed once. Their assessment starts at the first time they tell their story. We've worked really hard on developing outcome measures for our care pathways with our patients and staff, but we know we need to mature that further. So we're developing outcomes in terms of what patients report, in terms of their outcomes and their experience, as well as what the clinic clinicians feel um, patients have achieved and we know that we've got some further work to do in maturing those. And uh, Pat and Angela worked hard to get me here. I'm quite happy and content here. Do it. When they, when they knew that I could do it, they left me shoot so I didn't have them there. One by one, they went away. The first thing I said to the physios, the OTs was, look, if you want me to trust you, you've got to trust me. In my, I know what I'm capable of doing and what I ain't capable of doing. So we had an understanding from the beginning. So we're working at the moment on developing services for young people, by which I mean people between the ages of 14 and 25. Young people who develop either mental or physical health problems in that age range go on to have problems in adulthood if they're not properly um, treated at that point. However, working with people in, yeah, at the age of 14 to 25 can be really fulfilling and can help them to um, go on and live normal adult lives. Our future plans for the strategy include further developing the concept of integrated neighbourhood teams. This is where we work with GPs and other multidisciplinary team members in other services to wrap around services for patients in the community, helping them to stay in the community and supporting them from early discharge if they do end up having to go into hospital. Our ultimate goal is to promote the best health possible for all our patients and everybody in our communities and use the precious resources we've got for people at times when they most need clinical care.